back to my channel my name is Kaylee if you're new I film beauty lifestyle and travel related videos so if that is something you're into make sure you like comment and subscribe also hit those post notification bell so you always know when to upload a new video make sure you follow me on Instagram at just Kaylee Michelle and give me a like on Facebook by the same name so in today's video I'm actually going to be doing a TJ Maxx hygiene shop with me slash store walkthrough so I just wanted to see if they had anything new because I have been watching some videos and they've been seeming to have some pretty cool stuff in there so you know with TJ Maxx you have to go pretty frequently if you want to catch new things because once they are gone most of the time they are gone so make sure you watch this video to the end because i do have a small haul to show you guys some of the things that i got in the store and yeah let's just hop right into this walkthrough okay so we are in the store so the first item i see is this purity body wash and this is 17 dollars, and this is smaller than the ones that i usually get so that's what i mean by these are very expensive you have to swoop them when they are at a low price and then i was really happy to see this island bliss tree hut foaming wash because you know it's the new new in the store and then there's my pink animal cracker guys i was so happy to see that they had multiple ones of those but i did already get that and then i've been seeing this little strawberry um lotion pop up in the stores lately i did see this at another tj maxx as well a few days ago so i'm just looking around trying to see what they have to offer and they do have this british rose from the body shop and this is some hand wash and anytime i see body wash i mean body wash body shop items i get pretty excited and then they have this love beauty and planet lotion so they do have some pretty good brands you just have to really sift through the things and look around and see what they have you see they have some jason's they have some more philosophy items and i thought this body butter looked cool i've never heard of the brand honeybee before so i just wanted to pick that up and see what that was like but i did not purchase it and then we do have you know i like how they have everything color coordinated that's really cool and then they've been having some dr bronner's in here but to be honest with you i mean it's only two dollars less than what it is retail price in the actual store so i don't really know if that's a great deal or not but you know two dollars is two dollars i guess and i'm pretty blind so i could not see what the actual scent was for that dr bronner's or this one because i have a hard time finding what the scent is on these so my apologies for that but these are 11.99 then they have a bunch of those dove deodorants over there the dry sprays which are my favorite right now and then there's that blueberry wash that i got last week and then i thought this palmer's lotion was pretty cool because i'm used to just seeing the cocoa butter lotion and I've been seeing this little shimmer spray for the last few weeks, but it's really weird because there's no spray top to it at all. So I don't know how you're supposed to spray. <laughs> and then I've been seeing a lot of this Tree Hut charcoal detoxifying body wash. This actually looks pretty cool. Eventually I might pick it up, but it just hasn't piqued my interest enough to actually get it. And then they have a lot of those Nivea um, orange blossom body creams. And then I've also been seeing this Olay whip body mousse popping up as well and that does look pretty cool it looks like it smells pretty good so i just turned around too so i can just look at the face and skincare items and then i just picked up this little um sunscreen that they have and they do have a lot of great skincare items this pineapple flower setting mist looked really interesting to me but i did not pick it up i kind of regret it now that i'm looking back at this video but it looked pretty cool and then there are all those body shop face masks and for some reason they are a dollar difference in price like the one i just picked up was $7.99 and this one is $6.99 and i'm not, really not sure why So yeah, you can see they have some Neutrogena, they have some Clinique, they have some Biore. And I really thought this was really neat to look at because I've never seen a Biore 
like that before and then they had this beauty blender which was on sale it was actually on the clearance side so that's where i am right now just looking at the little clearance items but this end cap wasn't that interesting we have a little pixie set right here and i'm not even really sure what this brand is about but it just looked interesting the packaging looked kind of sleek to me so i had to pick it up and check it out and then i also had to check this out too because those are always in there and there's my euphoria i did not pick it up though because 40 dollars was not in the budget on this day <laughs> so unfortunately i had to just let it go and i'm wondering if they bring this stuff from the other stores if they don't sell at their stores because there's always just like a single thing sometimes and i've been seeing this burberry brick here um recently as well and I don't even know what this one is, but it was pink and sparkly, so I just had to pick it up. And then this is that Marc Jacobs Decadence. This is the one that's shaped like a purse. And I really want to try that out one day. And I'm not even sure what Euphoria Blush is, but the packaging looked really pretty. I need to look those notes up and just see. But they have a whole lot of gift sets, so if you are trying to shop for Mother's Day, CJ Maxx is a great place to get gift sets. And then they also have lots of bath tools. I really like the fact that they have sponges, they have loofahs, they have pretty much anything that you can need for your bath in here. And then they have all these scrubs over here too. Of course, no tree hut, but I thought these looked really cool and they actually smell very good. They really smell tropical and juicy, but I passed these up. And these are actually, this, this is actually the second time that I'm passing these up because they were in the store on Saturday as well. And then they do have a bunch of Epsom salt down at the bottom as well. So if you do like to take baths, you can get your salts from TJ Maxx. Dollar Tree is also a good place to get bath sauce as well um, so that you can soak. And I've been seeing this Pacifica Souffle a lot as well. One day I'll probably pick it up because I can't keep seeing something too much without getting it. And then they did have this Body Butter by Tree Hut, which I did see at the other TJ Maxx. But when I went back, it was not there, but now it's here. So that's why I'm starting to think that they are transporting products between locations. So over here just some more bath tools and then i saw these pretty bottles so these are body lotions they're, they're like some aromatherapy and i thought these were pretty cute and i did see this at the other tj maxx as well so these are just some milk bath bombs i thought those were so adorable because they look like little milk jugs and then this is some becca um highlighter and this is another clearance section so make sure you check all the clearance sections in your tj maxx because you might find some gems you never know because they do have multiple clearance sections and i really like the packaging on this because it was very um sleek looking and it was glass and i like anything that's glass here is the shade moisture foam body wash and they did have this for 450 i've been seeing that since last weekend as well looks like nobody picked it up Ren is also a very good brand and then they have that juicy couture we give set on sale for 40 dollars, which is a great deal because it has a few items in there and then here's their little mother's day section i thought these this stuff was really greatly priced because this set right here i think what was that 7.99 or 9.99 i'm not sure i can even really see right now but this one i really thought was cool because there's five samples of some bubble bath and also a big thing of body lotion and it's only eight dollars which is crazy and they have this little gift set down here which i really like because it has a robe it has a mug it has a couple other little things in there as well like some little spa items and this was only $24.99 for this whole set which is a great deal and then they have this little gift set of toka and these are in the little scents that they have in the perfumes and that was only $9.99 and i really thought this toothbrush looked cool it was only five dollars and then here's some oleology. I didn't even know that they made like actual food grade coconut oil. So I thought that was neat. And then look at this big candle. This is watermelon lemonade. Watermelon lemonade. I can't talk. And this was only $12. Like Bath and Body Works. Come on, y'all. 
raspberry grapefruit that's only $7.99 TJ Maxx is the goat for candles they have so many and then of course this caught my eye this is sea salt blossoms so, so we are back from the store hopefully you guys enjoyed that little walkthrough of the footage i was able to get i try to pretty much stay on track and just stay in the hygiene section but i always make my way around the whole store i have to see what else they have because of course there's more to life than hygiene even though that's what most of us love to see and i always have to go look at those candles i just have to look at the candles I have to see if there's anything new and this time they seem to have a lot more candles but I did not get any but I just wanted to go see what they had. Let's take a look at what I got. So the first two items that I'm going to show you I actually got them a few days ago and actually on Saturday today's Wednesday I got these on Saturday and I posted one of these on my community tab because I was so sad I didn't get to get it because I had to leave TJ Maxx early but I went to my regular TJ Maxx and I found it. So this is the pink frosted animal cracker from Philosophy. And this is shampoo, shower gel, and bubble bath. But I just like to use this as shower gel. Quite possibly bubble bath as well. This smells so good. I actually used this today. It smells like just like what it says. It's a nice, sweet, just smells very gourmand and lovely and I was so happy to pick this up because from one you see what color it is it's my favorite color it's nice and pink and it's just so cute and girly and gourmand so those are all the things that I love so I was happy to pick this up I did get this for $10.99 this size of philosophy pretty much goes for about 20 to 22 dollars actual retail price whenever i find those in tj maxx i swoop them up because they are expensive elsewhere because even at uh, walmart they're on sale where they were on sale for 14 dollars i still couldn't really bring myself to do that so 11 dollars is still a bit steep for shower gel but i decided to just go ahead and do it item that you did see in there this is the coconut and hibiscus foam body wash so this is from actual this is actually from Shea Moisture and I did get this on clearance for $4.50 and you did see this in the video they did have a couple of these left people didn't really seem to be interested in it I was Whoop. it definitely does have a nice scent I just got it all over me so apparently I'm taking a bath right now but I would not Say that this smells like hibiscus paradise from bath and body works that one's a little bit more citrusy but this is still a nice tropical scent so i really enjoy foaming body wash because you know us hygiene junkies we like that lather we like the foam we like to see those bubbles so whenever it comes in a foaming formula we are down for it <laughs> the items that i got today i only actually got two today and one of the items I was really, 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 really excited about because I've seen this in a video and I was like, please let my store have it. Please let my store have it. And they did. So this is the Tree Hut Foaming Body Wash. And this is in the scent Island. What is this? Island Bliss. <laughs> and this is in the scent Island Bliss. And I did get this for $3.99. So I was happy because I actually seen this last night in a video, to be honest. And... I'm trying to remember who I was watching. I feel like it was Self Care Catherine. I think I think that was her. Um, but you know, right now, especially in the hygiene community, tea tree tea tree tree hut items are a rare find. They are gems to find. So whenever you see them, snatch them up because you never know. Because there's a lot of other people out there like us. Because this is definitely a community at this point. And if you're in the know, you're in the know. So. Whoever sees this is gonna snatch it up. So they did only have three and now I have one in my possession. So I'm definitely excited to use this. The last item that I have for you guys, I did show this in the video. So this is some Toka hand cream. And these are all the scents that they have in the mini perfumes that I'm sure you've seen before. But I picked this up because of the nice price of $9.99. Of course, they got me with that. And I actually passed up the minis before and I regret it because I haven't seen them since. So I felt like if I at least have the hand cream, I can have some type of, you know, 
feeling of actually having to took a perfume so i cannot wait to sniff these and try these out i'm not going to open these up right now but if you go to your local tj maxx please try to find this because i feel like this is a great deal especially um for a high-end type of brand and you get three hand creams for only ten dollars so i'm definitely going to try these out to see what they smell like see if they have a nice perfume scent to them and see if they are moisturizing so yeah i only got those four items but i feel like they were great purchases i'm very happy with all of them i feel like they were nice rare finds and we love that so that will conclude today's video guys if you like more videos like this make sure you like comment and subscribe and i will see you in my next one bye guys